Hello everyone, this is the Archfiend, and well, I'm going back to my cereal. Hello viewers, I'm the Archfiend. I have two combat knives. Can of spam! I hope you'd enjoy tonight's video. iPods everywhere! I'm covered in money. <sighs> Hello everyone, this is the Archfiend. Rich people, they have it all. The houses, the cars, in some cases the women. But is that enough? Well, apparently not, because three men in Greenwich, Connecticut, just came forward and said they are the winners of that $254 million Powerball jackpot that no one knew who won exactly. There was a story that some guy lost a ticket and he was the one that played the numbers and all this other stuff was going around. Well, the three men came forward and guess what? They're filthy rich already. I don't get this. I don't get this at all. Um, why do rich people play the lottery? Why? Now, I'll leave a link in the video description explaining exactly what's going on here. Um, three men came forward. They said they won the Powerball lottery ticket in the hands of the ticket, and Connecticut gambling officials or whatever confirmed it. Now, the three men that are the winners are from some sort of like investment banking firm of some sort, asset firm, whatever. It doesn't matter what it is. The point is, they are filthy rich. They're already millionaires. They live in one of the most affluent communities in America, in Greenwich, Connecticut. These are people that haven't struggled to pay a bill in years. And now they just got tens upon tens of millions of more dollars. Now, am I bitter about this? M maybe, kind of. I know there's no written rule saying, oh, only poor people can play the lottery, but my biggest question is, is why would rich people play the lottery to begin with? Why would people, these three men, that could pretty much buy any house they wanted within reason, buy whatever car they want, live a life of retirement from this day on, even if they didn't win the lottery? Live happy and healthy and content. Or well, maybe wealth can't buy you complete health, but you get what I mean. They could get whatever they wanted. And yet, they decided to play the lottery. I guess I am sounding kind of bitter, aren't I? But here's where I'm getting with this. I've always looked at the lottery, and I'm not someone who plays the lottery that much at all. I might buy maybe five Powerball tickets a year just on a, just, you know, a hope that you could just end up winning just that one in a billion shot and be a filthy rich millionaire overnight. But these guys were already filthy rich, and that seems to be the point of which that's just the sticking point in my mind, because... Isn't the principle of the lottery to become, and I guess this is kind of just an arbitrary principle on my standards, isn't the principle of it just to be, you know, down on your luck, hopeful that you can be wealthy beyond your wildest dreams, and truly be able to appreciate that money that you're getting? These three guys that won, are they going to be able to appreciate this? They're going to be able to buy 10 more houses on top of the 10 houses they already own? That's the thing. I just They took away a dream, a, just a complete overwhelming fantasy from someone else. Someone that could have just been like, Oh my God, I never thought in my wildest dreams I could have won all this money. Oh, it just would have been just such a dream come true for someone. And these filthy rich people took that away from someone. They stole it. All right, maybe that's a little over the top, but... Now, I know a lot of you guys are going to say, Well, Archfiend, they announced that they're going to be donating a lot of that money to charity, so there's going to be a lot of good causes that are going to be helped out from this. Well, if that's the case, is, is that why rich people play the lottery? To give money to charity? In other words, they, you know, maybe may have not have been as charitable unless they won the lottery? 
that's all well and good, and I'm, that's, I'm grateful that, you know, a number of charities are going to be, you know, making advancements because of this money. But is that the principle and the foundation of what a lottery is built upon? A lottery is a dream. It's a fantasy. It's something of what millions upon millions of people play to hope that, you know, maybe they don't have to work their 9 to 5 job anymore. Maybe they'll get out of that mountain of debt that they're in. Maybe they'll be able to afford that child support because, you know, they weren't smart enough to wrap their whopper and knock up six different women. It's all those things pulled together. Who wins? One of the biggest Powerball jackpots in history are won by three very filthy rich millionaires. Isn't that wonderful? I don't know. I, I just this, when this story broke, it just I, I I remember this happening one time before. Some guy down in Texas won a very big. It was either Powerball, or Mega Millions, jackpot, and he had like like hundreds of millions of dollars to his name already. And I was just like, why did he play the lottery to begin with? I just I I just don't get it. I don't get why very wealthy people play the lottery. Why steal that dream from the millions of just peons, for lack of a better term? that play that lottery, who take that dollar out of that pocket because that dollar actually means something to them. Not these guys who took one dollar out of their million dollar coffers and just threw it in and said, oh yeah, I'll just take a quick pick number and boom, they end up winning. They took away that dream and fantasy from someone that could have really appreciated that money. But. There is no rules saying you have to be rich or poor to play or that, you know, anyone can't win or can win, so it's a free country and we just got to deal with it. Doesn't mean people like me can't be bitter about it. Just something to think about here today. I don't know what you guys, you know, think about this or whether, you know, the people deserve that money or not it, or should even matter what their wealth status is. But the bottom line is, is these three people are very, very rich and they won the lottery and now they're richer. The rich got richer. What does that mean? I don't know. You tell me. Have a great day, everyone. And a better tomorrow. And a good luck to everyone playing the Powerball. I have you know, nothing left to end this with. Everyone put their monster paws up. See how many people get that reference. Take care.